Alright, so sometimes you might want to share your internet. Maybe you just have one internet connection, maybe just one cable or um, one um, modem, and possibly you just have you have more than one computers, and you are wondering how you're gonna be able to share that computer. I mean that internet from your computer to the other computers in the same room. Well, there is actually a nice and cool little trick. You use this software called Connectify and with that software actually you're able to um, share your your internet which you're accessing on one computer you're able to share it to other computers through either Wi-Fi or uh, or um, or uh, or cable um, this uh, program simulates it makes your computer a hotspot so um, let's just go straight um, to go to your go to your browser and in there just type connectify it's called connectify and the website there is on top connectify.me dot me uh, you can try with the free version although it has some uh, it has some you can't access some features just go to download there and then make your way down here email me you don't have to keep me up to date you don't have to just click on download now and then it will give you the trial version of not a trial version it's the full version just that you can be able to to make um, to maybe give your hotspot the name that you want and such features okay you just download it okay I won't download since I already have it downloaded it's here on my desktop then let's install it yeah actually I spent quite a lot of time trying to trying to find a way of doing this thing because ever since I had a computer more than one computer and maybe just one internet connection I couldn't be able to share that internet through the other to the other computers I had to buy two internet internet sticks and that was quite costly for me anyway so let's just wait here Alright, so now our um, our um, software is installed. Let's open the software through our shortcut here. You can see here it says um, um, hotspot name. You're supposed to change. You're supposed to change it to the name that you want for your hotspot. Actually, um, I don't have the trial version. I have the full version. So I'm actually able to change this name to whichever name I want. I'm just gonna change it to that. And the password, I will just put one. Okay, wait. And the password, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'll just put eight A's. Internet to share. Wait, I have to connect my internet since I'm using my USB stick. So I'm loading my internet because right now it doesn't show there. It's called ZTE. Alright, so let's connect and wait and see. Okay. Still not showing. Yeah, there it is. ZTE wireless terminal. So click on it. Let me first um, get it back to the way it was and put 8S 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. All right, so I want um, on the internet to share tab. That's where you say which internet you actually have. Mine, since I'm using um, USB stick, and this is the name of the USB stick that I'm using. So I just select it. If you're using a cable, you select probably that. You can see there is the small picture icon of a cable there. All right, um, if you want to share it over Wi-Fi you select Wi-Fi there if you wanna share it um, through the cable you have to have the internet cable and you connect it to your computer and then to the router and maybe to other computers or directly from one computer to another computer and then then you click there and then you click start hotspot then you wait a bit then it will configure let me actually switch on the wireless on my phone it's an Android phone so 
I will expect that it shows by the name here on the clients tab all right so it says starting hotspot let's wait and see if it connects or not okay so you can see that it's already connected there it's saying sharing ZTE wireless terminal but then I'm still not yet connected my phone is not yet connected because here and this tab you should see connected to my hotspot you should see the name of my device here and that's my phone but it doesn't show there yet so let me let me um, go to my wireless settings on my phone it's actually scanning okay let me connect it password a a a a a a a a connect alright so let's wait and see if it will show there on my on um, on this on this um, dashboard um, all devices that connect through this um, all devices that connect through the um, hotspot shield you can be able to see here so you can see here connected to my hotspot one device and that's my device Android and that's the number of my Android device um, if someone else also connects through my um, hotspot they will have to provide the same password and then it will show here connected to my hotspot then it will change to two and the name of that device and that's it um, if you want to disconnect you just stop the hotspot or you can log out from your the other computer or disconnect the cable or disconnect the Wi-Fi and by the way for this your Wi-Fi has to be on your Wi-Fi switch on your laptop if you decide to use the Wi-Fi um, otherwise you can just stop the hotspot there um, you are the administrator in this case and you're able to um, also ban some people like ban some clients if you go to my clients let's connect again um, if someone actually connects through connects to your hotspot and you don't you don't want you can actually just block them you can say you can say no actually I don't want this person to connect to my hotspot and uh, let's wait for my device to connect um, let me switch it on through my yeah there it is when you right click on that device you can disable local access you can disable internet access this person is not able will not be able to access your internet again you can copy the IP address and stuff like that you can rename it so that you know well how to who's using a computer your your internet I mean alright so that's it um, feel free to subscribe to my channel or post a comment or even like this video cheers